MYFWB may loan me out to her sorority sister, F for a night. No regrets the morning came and May left early with Sarah and headed back to her place to get ready for her event. I had made plans to meet Sarah at May's and head out to lunch slash drinks. Once the girls were gone May texted me about how excited and nervous Sarah was after reading May's text from the night before. That was all she left me with. So I made my way over to meet up with Sarah and went to lunch. It was a while in the wall sports bar near that had a rooftop deck. We grabbed a drink and an app. The conversation was kind of awkward. We both knew what was going on but neither of us had said anything up to this point. Me not being one to let the awkwardness linger I asked her about the text she got last night from May. She immediately blushed and laughed and said she wished she hadn't gotten so intoxicated that it looks like she missed all the fun. After that the conversation shifted. She relaxed and began to be super flirty. There was some touching and snuggling if you will at the table as we finished our drinks. When the waiter came by to ask about another round Sarah just said no we'll take the check. When I left I asked what the plan was from here. She said she could really go for a beer in the hot tub since she missed out last night. I was more than happy to make that happen. We walked a few blocks to my place holding hands and giggling the whole way. Once we got back I cracked some beers and told I was going to change and painted her in the bathroom for her to do the same. She just looked at me and said she didn't have a suit and May had told her that there were no suits allowed in the hot tub. Bold I thought but hey the girl knows what she wants. We grabbed our beers and a couple extra along with some towels and headed out back. As I set up the hot tub, put the beers in the outdoor fridge and turned a football game on she quickly got undressed and in the tub before I could even get a glimpse of. Her and Ked body. She has delved into me telling me to hurry up and what is taking me so long. I handed her my beer and could tell she was intently watching as I got ready to drop my pants. Again I'm not the biggest but my semi got a smirk from her and I entered the tub. We cheersed and drank and I slid over next to her. I couldn't really see anything but the top of her BBS due to the bubbles. Her hair was up in a bun and she was relaxing in the corner seat as I slid over next to her. I immediately felt her hand on my thigh moving up to my pee pee. She said as she squeezed me that she couldn't wait to see what all the fuss was about. We started making out and she gently stroked me under the bubbles. I reached my hand over and grabbed her bobs and played with her nipples which delivered a small gasp as we broke out kiss. We had been in there at least 15 minutes since the timer went off and the jet stopped. With that I could finally get a glimpse of her under the water. I moved her between my legs with her back to me. I began massaging her shoulders and worked my way back to her TTS while kissing her neck. I took one hand and ran it down her stomach over her neatly trimmed short bush straight to her wimp. I began working her CLT as I kissed her back and played with her nipple with my other hand. Her breathing began to pick up and her soft moans grew a little louder. She was probably pretty close to seeming but I stopped and told her we needed to move this inside. I got it first and turned to give her a hand and that was the first time I got a full body. Let me tell you she didn't disappoint. Perfect perky CTTS with some nice dark pepperoni nipples, amazing toned stomach, neatly trimmed shot bush with beautiful dangling lip on her wimp. I handed her her towel and we sprinted up to the bedroom. She hopped on the bed and laid back with her head propped up on the pillows. I went straight in and started with my tongue in her wimp. I tongue after her and made my way to her CLT as I slipped two fingers in her. She was moaning and shouting to keep going and how good it was. She dug her nails in the back of my head and she began to buck and have her first organs of the day. As she came down I went up to kiss her and caress her TTS. She flipped me on my back and got between my legs and told me to relax. She was able to deep throat me on the first go. She spent the next several minutes devouring my pee pee like it was her last meal on earth. She was pretty good but what got me was when she deep throated me and was able to stick her tongue out and lick my balls at the same time. I have never had any ever do that before or since then. I pulled her up when I felt myself getting close and asked her how she wanted to be effed. She grinned and said she wanted to ride me. She made her way up and tried to stick my pee pee and when I stopped her telling me to let me grab a CNDM. I told her that was May's only rule. She understood and grabbed the CNDM and put it on me and spit on it before she sank down on me. She went down with ease with how what she was. She went right to squat effing me cowgirl hard and loud telling me to squeeze her nipples and slap her SS. She got tired and went to her knees grinding on me while playing with her CLT. It wasn't long till she climaxed again and fell on top of me kissing and squirming with my PP still in her. As she kissed my neck and chest I told her it was my turn to F her now. I flipped her on her back and pulled her to the edge of the bed, put her feet on my chest and stuck my PP right in. I started off slow playing with her nipples taking long slow strokes. As I built my pace I started kissing her feet and licking her toes. She went wild and really loved that attention on her feet. She began to be even more vocal telling me to destroy her wimp and that this wimp is yours now. Her eyes rolled back in her head as I pounded her as hard as I could as she played with her CLT. I felt myself getting super close. I pulled out and told her to get on her knees. I ripped the CNDM off and shot the first rope across her face before she got my PP in her mouth and sucked the rest of the CM out of me. She cleaned up and we laid in bed talking for a while. She told me how much she needed that and would have to plan a visit back soon. In the back of my mind I knew we had the rest of the day and part of the next day so I thought I'd get to F her again before she left. We ended up going back to the hot tub, drinking, watching a game and teasing each other till May got back from her event. To come